Hej, cześć, witam Was wszystkich bardzo serdecznie z tej strony 352 i moi drodzy, witam Was w dziewiątym odcinku z serii Zagrajmy w Risen. Moi drodzy, weszliśmy do miasta i teraz już tak szybko z niego nie wyjdziemy. Tu jest Delgado. You tell the wrong people, you can get yourself in trouble. You've had trouble with the law. Ha! The law is just an excuse to lock us all in the town. The Order wants to loot the ruins in peace. Once they've taken the last crumb of gold out of the ruins, they'll let us out again. Don Esteban figured that out right away. Why are you in the town and not in the swamp? Simple. The Don doesn't let go of things that belong to him. Some of us are keeping business going here, until the Inquisition move on. What business do you do? Anything that brings gold. Gold's the only way we can challenge the Order and the Warriors, isn't it? Taking the town back is what it's all about. We control the town, we control the island. For now, though, the Inquisitor and Commandant Carlos are in charge. So what's your step? All right. What's the order doing about the Don's men? They stop us where they can. Since they came here with their fancy white uniforms, they've never taken their eyes off us. They're just waiting for us to step out of line. Then they'll take us to the monastery. Keep your eye out for Sebastian. He's always around, watching. Tell me about Commandant Carlos. He's the Inquisitor's watchdog. His headquarters is in the guardhouse. He sits up there controlling everyone's lives. But it's only a matter of time before he pisses enough people off. Sounds like you could use some help. We could. I have to scrape together a lot of gold for the Don. If I don't send him something soon, if I don't get some gold in, I'll have problems with my own boys. If you help me, i can cut you in for a slice. What are you offering if I do help you? Well, I'll give you gold. And I can teach you a few things too. Give a man a fish, and he'll stick for a day. Give him a rod. You want to teach me to fish? In a manner of speaking. Fish for gold. I can make a pickpocket out of you. Word to the wise. You should look to the Don. Join him before you get swallowed and pissed out by the order. What can I do? Hmm. Costa the pawnbroker's doing good business here in the gutters. He's preying on the farmers and stuffing his pockets with gold. So, what do you need doing? Since the order has been here, he hasn't paid his dues to the Don. Hired himself a bodyguard he has and he pays the Inquisition's taxes. What about the Don's taxes, eh? Where's our slice? Someone needs to make sure we get paid. Dobra, na razie się nie będę na nic deklarować, ponieważ no chcemy grać po stronie Inkwizycji, dlatego tutaj Delgado niestety będzie musiał zostać przeze mnie dosyć stłamszony. No i co? I myślę, że może najpierw przejdziemy się w tę stronę. Co tam, moi drodzy, u was? Ja jestem w sumie dzisiaj troszeczkę taka... Dużo bardziej więcej energii mam niż w niedzielę na przykład. Także w sumie cieszy mnie to bardzo. Przestraszyłam się tej tekstury, która się tutaj ruszała, myśląc, że coś tu jest. E, dzisiaj jestem dużo bardziej żywsza. Od razu po ósmej w sumie poszłam z Damianem do sklepu, bo miał zacząć wcześniej pracę, ale nagle okazało się, że odwali mu spotkanie w robocie i mieliśmy takie... Aha, no to albo zaczynasz o 8, albo w tym czasie zdążymy zrobić razem zakupy. No i akurat poszliśmy do sklepu. Czekam też na dwóch kurierów, z czego jedna paczuszka to będzie nowy fotel. Bardzo się cieszę, bo mimo, że mam ergonomiczny fotel, to w chuj bolą mnie plecy. Tego się nie da otworzyć. Serio, powiem wam, że ja naprawdę nie wiem, jak to się dzieje. Ja mogę boleć plecy na ergonomicznym fotelu. Nie wiem, po prostu, po prostu nie wiem. Mam 22 lata, bo jestem świeżo po urodzinach, po czym bolą mnie plecy od dobrych paru lat, nie? Nie mogę nic z tym zrobić. 
Dobra, pogadajmy może z tym gościem, który pilnuje magazynu. Jest to kolejny ogr. Halt. No one can enter this warehouse. Everything all right, big guy? Everything is all right. I'm looking for training. Ukos can train you. Train you in strength. Train you with an axe. I must ask for a little gold. Against my honor. But Ukos needs gold for the butcher shop. Okay, wyobrażam sobie ciebie jako rzeźnika. I'd like to train. Fajnie, bo uczysz siły. I to pora. No dobrze. A co się dzieje tutaj? Hey, wait. Not here. Huh? We talk here, Carrasco will listen. He doesn't have to know everything. Let's go somewhere else. Okay. W porządku. Dziwne to miasto. You have a problem with Carrasco. Well, let's see. All those temples turn up, and we're thinking, hurrah, the gods have finally smiled on us. Then the Inquisition arrive, take over our island, and start claiming all the treasure belongs to them. How would you feel? But do you have a particular problem with Carrasco? He's the worst of them. Claims I've been stealing. Even had me searched. But he's never found anything. It's an outrage. An outrage, I tell you. I'm looking for work. You could lug crates, but you have to talk to Carrasco. But you don't look like the crate lugging kind of guy. What do I look like? Like someone who will willingly take greater risks for greater profits. So you don't think stealing is an outrage? Taking from the orders, not stealing. It's our duty. I'll pay a few lads to liberate items from the warehouse. I'm damned if I'm letting the Inquisition get all the treasure. But those lads have run up tabs to pay. They've bedded too many wenches. They're getting greedy. And I won't have that. Which lads are causing trouble? There's Durham. He's a worker from the harbour. Who else? Ingvar and Vasily. Neither of them has a proper job, so they're just work for hire. Most of the time they can be found in Patty's tavern. Fine woman she is. How exactly have they got greedy? They stole five ancient armor plates that were found in the ruins. Can this armor be used? You mean to improve your own armor? Yes. They're more ceremonial than practical, but they're still very valuable. What's in it for me, if I help? You can have the gold I offered them. Fifty gold pieces for each plate. Five plates, that's 250 all in. 250 is a good price. You won't get that much coin faster and easier anywhere else. Agree. What do you want doing with these lads? How should I handle it? Any way you like. They've crossed me for the last time. Do what you have to do. Just get me those armor plates back. And don't let them fall into Carrasco's hands. Dobra, na razie się nie będziemy tutaj deklarować. Pogadajmy sobie dalej z Inkwizycją. I'd stop right there if I were you. You ain't going any further. What's the problem? The order runs this warehouse now. So what? So they don't want anyone wandering in uninvited. Wandering uninvited types tend to wander out again with stuff that ain't theirs. What sort of trouble? Artifacts smuggled. It's bad enough these artifacts have been stolen in the ruins. You'd think they'd be safe in town in the warehouse, but there are thieves everywhere, trying to undermine the order. Can I help? Well, the latest things to go missing were three golden bolts. The Inquisitor was not impressed. I could do with getting those back. And I need to get hold of some armor plates that walked out the warehouse a few days ago. Where did the golden balls come from? An illegal excavation at an old temple outside the town. 
Since we heard about that, talk says someone's been trying to sell three golden bowls on the black market. Idiots. To resist the order is crazy. We're driven by a greater force, a higher purpose. I heard something about those armor plates you're looking for. Tongues are already wagging, are they? Not good. Not good at all. That means they'll soon be for sale and on their way out of town. That man almost makes me want to go back to using my fists again. Talk to him, find out what he knows. No, dobra. Let's talk compensation. I was like you once, all about the gold and the dark place. I hope you find your higher purpose. Nothing in this town is free, especially not me. Have it your way. If you help me, you can choose your reward. No i dobra, na razie też się nie będziemy deklarować. Hey. Hey, yourself. Dobra, dobra, wiemy. Tutaj w sumie można by się było też przejść na koniec. Yes. What do you want? Do these ships really need guarding? Ships? No. Cargo, yes. And while these ships are stuck here, it's the Inquisition's duty to protect them. So here I am. You're a warrior of the order. Your keen intellect tell you that. Your armor did. Yes. I am a warrior of the Order of the Holy Flame. That's a big title for a guard. How did you become a warrior of the Order? The Inquisitor himself chose me. He took me to the monastery for training. So you were forced into service? No. The service found me and I found the service. I wish more people would sign up. Do their duty. Every man must find their calling. What's the Inquisitor like? You haven't met him. He's a hard man with firm principles. Once he has his eyes on a goal, no one can stop him. You can't help but admire a man like that. I suppose not. If you stay within the law, you have nothing to fear from him. What if I don't agree with the law? Then you better hope you don't meet him. Have you caught people trying to steal from the ships? There are those stupid enough to try, but nothing escapes my eagle eyes. Nothing. Of course not. Don't mock. You don't want to end up like our prisoner in the Harbor Key jail, do you? What did the prisoner in the jail do? Captain Romanoff is a pirate. Was a pirate. Now he's just another prisoner. We caught him smuggling goods from the mainland for the Don. Of course, Romanoff's not the sort to pay for goods. He plundered, burned, and killed his way across the coast. Until the Inquisitor caught up with him. You see? Law and order. Safety. The Don is gone, and soon we'll find the gold Romanov was paid by him. Until he tells us where that is hidden, he'll rot in his cell. Has Romanov told you anything so far? Not much. He's tight-lipped for a braggart. But a few more weeks, rotting in jail, and he'll speak. You hope. Maybe I can get Romanov to talk. Ha! Why would he tell you where he's hidden it? We'll find it. The gold can't be far, and there are only so many places to hide it. I'll find Romanov's gold. How? We've been trying for days without success. But if you did manage to find it, you would of course be rewarded. I'd need to be. Dobra. Czy to oznacza, że mogę pogadać sobie z więźniem? Did Romanov work alone? What happened to his crew? 
With the storms out to sea, they'll be laying low in the town, hiding from the Inquisition. Why didn't the Order take Roman off to the monastery like all the others? I haven't the foggiest. The white robes don't tell people, but I like it that way. The less I know, the more I can keep my head down. Can I talk to Roman up? You can, but he won't hear, because he's in the cell and you're staying out here. And the key to his cell is staying in my pocket. Got that? No, dobra. So, what do you want to let me in? All the other town guards are having a great time in the tavern or at Sonia's. The island's falling apart while they party, but I'm not allowed to leave my post. I've been here for days, wet, cold, knackered. Romanov may be important, but he's not going anywhere. The only person to give me the time of day is you. And you're not exactly a sight for sore eyes. But well, I mean, if one of Sonya's girls came up here, then, hey, the two of us could make a bit of a party. Tell you what, I'll send one of Sonya's girls over. In return, you let me talk to Romanov. Hmm. Well, yep, it's a deal. <laughs> Be quick, though. Oh, and don't bring a girl with a face like a smashed crab, or the deal's off. No, dobra. No, to chyba to nie będzie jakiś kłopot, nie? Tutaj widzieliśmy, że była jakaś lasunia, ale ona mówiła, że trzeba najpierw porozmawiać z Madame. Więc porozmawiajmy z nią. I could use your services. There's a guard over on the harbor key. Listen, gold first, pleasure second. Those are the rules. Pay at Madame Sonia's, and then we'll talk. Dobra, tak jak myślałam, także myślę, że możemy do niej od razu iść, ponieważ się domyślam, gdzie ona będzie. Dobra, tutaj jest Duram Wasyl, ale burdel mamy gdzieś tutaj, nie? Kurde, dużo ludzi, z którymi możemy porozmawiać. Bardzo dużo. Well, you look like you've got deep pockets. And there's no better place to dig into them than Madame Sonia's house of pleasure. We've got something to suit all tastes. And the girls there are talented, flexible and life free. Good to know. Okay. Ale podsumowała wszystko. Jak są wolne od wszy, to naprawdę normalnie super. Nie wnikam. Po prostu, po prostu nie wnikam. Zbadamy sobie ogródeczek. It's very simple, sweetie. You want something, you pay for it. And there's no discount for rugged and handsome here. What can you offer me? You are in the finest bottle in town. If you can't find it here, it's not worth having. Uh, najlepszym, ponieważ jedynym. Do you also sell information? If you have the gold, I have the knowing. Give me ten gold coins, then ask your question. Mm -hmm. If I can answer it, sweetie, then I will. And if I can't, then I still keep the gold. How does that deal work for me? Believe me, there's little that goes on around here that doesn't come through my doors sooner or later. Comforting to know. But no risk, no fun. Right? Ej, ja mam takie pytanie. Tutaj jest cena seksu? Bo mi się wydaje, że nie ma. Bo ja chciałabym spróbować. So if I was a customer, who would you recommend to me? Olga's over there. She's a lovely girl. Very friendly and extremely flexible. And behave yourself, understand? I don't want to hear any complaints. Noc z Olgą. No dobrze. A gdzie ona jest niby? I can tell you're hungry for the kind of adventure that only Olga can bring. I see things. I know things. It's just Madame Sonia and a few gold coins stand in your way. I paid Sonia for your services. I understand what a man wants. You're an explorer, am I right? An adventurer. Come conquer my continents, lover. Mm. It's a 
Could I take you to a few places you've not seen before? Yeah, you could say that. I wonder why I haven't seen you before. I've seen many things. Things that are unseen by most. I'm psychic. I haven't been here long. And you don't plan on staying long, right? No, I have business to take care of. Pity, but something tells me you will prove important to this place. So let me give you something for the hard road ahead. If you have upset another and they will not speak to you, then this scroll will soothe them. It contains a powerful spell, so use it wisely. Thank you, Olga. I wish you luck on your continued adventures. I feel you may need a great deal of it. E, dobra, czyli sceny nie było. Typowo. Jednakże było doświadczenie i dostałam za to zwój. I'd like to hire the services of one of your girls for the cell guard on the harbor key. Harbor key, you say? Hmm. Take Annika. She normally works that area, though she may not want to go with your cell guard friend, and that's her choice. Annika, got it. At the harbor key. Thanks. No, i dobra. I na razie to chyba. I do need information. I'm all ears. Moment. Dobra, nie będziemy może o to pytać na razie. Tell me about you. How's business? The Inquisition don't care about maintaining order in a brothel. So they turn a blind eye when our clients reach a new level of disgusting. Just take a look at that bastard over there. His name's Ericsson. Drinks all day and hits my girls. My regular guards left town and Ericsson won't listen to me. Dirty scum. Just ask my girl Gwen what kind of a monster he is. With the Inquisition ignoring us? There can be no justice for a place like this. We're stuck at the mercy of bastards like Ericsson. Okay, czyli chyba możemy ten temat troszeczkę poszerzyć, prawda? Just leave me alone. I'm not even here, all right? What's the matter? It's that drunken pig, Ericsson. Sits on that bench all day, eyeing me up, licking his lips. Making his hand gestures. It's so creepy. And then I find out he paid Madame Sonia for me. I refused to go with him and he beat me. Bastard. Didn't anyone help you? Like who? Madame Sonia's afraid of him too. The white robes ain't interested in us a lot. And you can forget about the town guard. Corrupt as the day is long, the lot of them. I'll take care of him. Really? You do that? I'd give the last of my savings to someone who'd make sure he never goes near Madame Sonia's again. Be careful. He's a vindictive bastard. Thanks for the warning. Is Ericsson one of the Don's men? Ha! <laughs> the Don's men are gentlemen compared to him. He comes right out of the town cesspit. Then I'll make sure I stay upwind of him. No, dobra. Czy ja właśnie... Okej, okay, nieważne chyba. Gdzie ta menda jest? Czy tu nie było gdzieś... Nie. A moment. Mogę po prostu iść tutaj spać? Mogę. To trochę dziwne, ale niech będzie. W ogóle właśnie przyszedł kurier, więc musiałam na chwilę przerwać nagrywanie. What's your problem? Had a few, have you? Weird. You're missing the tits, so you can't be my mother. Do us both a favor and go screw yourself. You're gonna tell me what I need to know. Come on, let's get this done. Time to fight. Oh, Panie Christa. Pięknie. Klucz do drzwi. Ciekawe. Right. 
what you want. I've got a message for you. Leave now if you know what's good for you. And if you even look at the girls here again, you'll regret it. Oh, lover, are you? Well, save your effort. I was gonna go anyway. Stay here long enough, you'll catch the pox. Then maybe you already have. Tell me about the key you had on you. If I tell you who that belongs to, I'd be digging my own grave. Now leave me alone. Good job, sweetie. That bastard Ericsson had it coming. That drunk Ericsson has taken off. That's a way off my mind and no mistake. I think that warrants a reward. No i dobra, tutaj pięknie mamy. Jeszcze możemy do Gwen iść. Ericsson got what he deserved. Yeah, I saw you gave him quite the beating. Glad in my heart it did, but it ain't enough. In a few days I'll be back on that bench again. Staring, licking, gesturing. I don't think Ericsson will show his face here again. That's a relief and a half, I tell you. You're a good man. Here's that gold I promised. Don't worry, I'll earn it back soon enough. I've got a few specialist tricks. Take care of yourself, all right? Thanks. You too. No i dobra, fajnie. U, jeszcze mi dała zapłatę. No to co, w burdelu już sprawa załatwiona chyba na amen, nie? No dobrze. Ja chyba wiem, do czego jest ten klucz. Albo nie, ale można by spróbować. Tu jest w jednym miejscu, w tym mieście taka chata i ona jest zamknięta. Tak jest, to był klucz właśnie tutaj. Mamy rum, wytrych, ząb, złoty kielich i stary dokument. Tak mi się właśnie wydawało, że to będzie tutaj. Nie ten ptak z jadrobaka, co bezczynnie siedział. Północny wschód na wschód, stary grób będzie wiedział. Ges, mamy to. Na razie nam to nic nie mówi, ale jak pójdziemy do Pati, to będziemy wszystko już wiedzieć. Natomiast ja na razie do Pati nie idę. Chciałabym ogarnąć sprawę z kapitanem Romanowem. Jak już ją zaczęliśmy, to wypadałoby troszeczkę ją, bo ja wiem, przyspieszyć. Także pójdziemy do pani lekkich obyczajów i pójdziemy potem do Marka. Hej, Sonia, for your services. So then, your place or mine? It's not for me. Marek, one of the guards, would like to get to know you better. A little bit shy, is he? You could say that. Oh, I know the type. Where is the timid fella? He's standing guard by the cells on the harbour quay. Oh, that guy? Beard? Eyebrows like the fattest caterpillars I've ever seen. Oh, well... I suppose gold is gold. Dobra, ona teraz do niego idzie. My go chodźmy uprzedzić i będziemy mogli pogadać sobie z kapitanem. Tak trochę od dupy strony zaczęłam zwiedzanie tego miasta. Anika will keep you company. Nice. I've been looking forward to this. Right. Come with me where no one can see us. Once Anika is here, then. Dobra, no ona zaraz powinna tu przyjść. Tell someone who cares. Dobra, no to teraz musimy na nią troszeczkę poczekać. Idzie ta kobiecina i idzie. Super. Right. You've had your fun. Now the key to the cell, please. Here. But if this lands me in trouble, I'll make you pay. Got it. Zdobądź klucz do celi Romanowa. Klucz Marka.
Let's see who they're sending me now. You another gutter dog, errand boy. You even think of asking about my gold. I'll rip out your tongue and feed it to the rats. I heard you're a pirate. We're starting with the hard questions, are we? Can see why they sent you, gutter dog. You're gonna point out I'm in prison next? Or ask me if the food's all right? Just answer the question. You are a pirate, right? Pirate? Murderer? Criminal? Thief? I've been called a lot. Now they want to stick me in a cell to let me rot. The world is going to hell. I've been to hell and came back whole. I stared down the throat of the beast, watched water turn to stone, and cities tremble as it swept down upon them. Now they want to stick me in a cell to let me rot. You think that makes sense in these times, gutter dog? I'm sure letting you wander the streets will be a great comfort to the people here. The world's coming apart. We can all see our end in it. What comfort is there to be had in that? You've sailed out. In these storms. Seen a hundred ships founder. The waters swallow the men. But I've never seen the sea watch a man. Choose its time. Until now. Whatever is out there circling this island is doing that. Choosing its time. These temples that rose from the earth, the creatures that came with them, they're nothing. Nothing compared to what is coming next. And no one can stop it. Not you, not me. And sure as hell, not the Inquisition. Do you have a problem with the Inquisition and the Order? Who do you think locked me up here? One day that Inquisitor will pay. He won't see me coming. How long have you been here? A few days. They think they're softening me up. They want to know where I hid my gold. And here was me thinking I only cared about spiritual matters. The door is open. You're free. I'll leave when I want to. At least I get free food here. So why don't you escape? Escape to where? You seen any ships come here in a week, a month? That's because they're all at the bottom of the sea in pieces. We've got little time to settle our reckonings before we meet our maker. And I have reckonings to settle on this island. Can't be nice here. It's damn, drafty. Can tell you never lived at sea. But this rancid clothing does mean no good. Sure time normally means clean clothes. I've been sweating into this shirt for five straight weeks. I have an old chest in the warehouse on the Harbor Quay. There's a casket in there with shirts in it. You bring that casket to me, maybe then we can talk about things. I might even throw a few coins your way. Deal. I'll bring you your casket. Here's the key to the chest. It's on the upper floor of the warehouse on the Harbor Quay. Won't be easy to get to. I can see you're the resourceful type. After you've got the stuff, come straight back here and keep the casket hidden. You give me your word on that. You must really be fond of your shirts. You have my word. Just get going before I stink myself into an early grave. I know what you think about the Inquisition. What do you think about the Don? I've known Esteban for a long time. He's a good man. Keeps his word. And there are a few men I know of who do that. Least of all, honest men like the Inquisitor. Or join the Order and believe your soul will be saved by a flame. <laughs> no, dobra. Problem polega na tym, że nie umiem się skradać. I to jest bardzo duży problem. Także chyba wypadałoby spróbować pogadać z Delgado, bo wydaje mi się, że on może nas nauczyć, ale w momencie, gdy mu się zadeklarujemy. Ha. Zaraz zresztą zobaczymy. Miejmy nadzieję, że tak będzie. Zresztą mówił coś o tym, że może nas czegoś nauczyć. 
I'll get your gold. Good. It's time we showed him we're still in charge in the gutters. But it won't be easy. Costa won't pay voluntarily. At least, not now he's got himself a bodyguard. How should I get the gold from him? I really don't care. If you give him a beating, you can probably just take it. But don't kill him. No point killing the Golden Goose. And it will get the Inquisition on our backs. But teaching his bodyguard a lesson wouldn't hurt. How much does Costa owe? He's caused a lot of trouble. I'd say he owes 300 gold coins for that alone. You can keep half. Zaraz. On nas chyba tego nie nauczy. Jest tutaj jeszcze jeden gościu. Nazywa się Sid. I chyba nas Sid właśnie nauczy ewentualnie skradania się. Hey, they call me Sid. I hope you're not some faceless minion of the order. What do you know about the Order? The Order locks us in the town like cattle and drags men off to the monastery. Take Rodriguez, a good man, reliable. And now, he did something to his mind up at the monastery. It got to him. Now he's just a tool of the Inquisitor. It's evil, stirring people's brains round like that. What was Rodriguez before? He was a decent, honest thief. Salted the earth. They caught him outside looting. Took him off and changed him. Poor fool guards the slaughterhouse by the harbor for the order now. Do you need help? It's Rodriguez. He's out to get me. He's part of the order. You're on my side, so do me a favor. Find out what he's planning and tell me. Aha, czyli nie mo... Aj, aj, aj. Niedobrze. To na razie tę sprawę chyba musimy zamknąć. Niech i tak będzie w takim razie. Tutaj jeszcze jest roślinka. No dobra. Wait, I saw you talking to Delgado. Do you deny it? No. And who are you? I am Sebastian, a warrior of the Order of the Holy Flame. And you want to be careful who you get involved with. What do you know about Delgado? He is one of Don Esteban's men. Ruthless, a lot of them. They steal, lie and extort. Stay clear of them. What are you doing about the Don's people? Inside the temple. Cornering them like rats in a burrow. Outside the town, the Inquisitor is slowly choking them, starving them of men, of gold, of food. Commandant Carlos will see the town is cleared of the Don's influence, and those left in the swamp will just wither and die. We'll finish to the battle, and the Don will fight. Why don't you just throw the Don's men out of the town? We've tried. They get back in. We don't know where or how. So now we'll use them. Finish them where they stand. You'd better decide whose side you're on. You want to be a rat or a rat catcher? How can I help you? I need to know what Delgado is planning. He's careful. He knows I'm following him, but he is up to something. Since you have spoken to him, maybe you can find out for me, and we can block up another of the Don's rat holes. What's in it for me if I help? It will stand you in good stead if you'd like to go to the monastery. Our commander appreciates help, and the monastery can train you as a maid or as a warrior of the order. It would be your choice, and of course you will receive a reward. How high is the reward for Delgado? One hundred gold pieces. Kurde no. Na razie się nie opowiadam po żadnej ze stron. Sporo tych ludzi.
A tego kufra wygląda na to, że nikt nie pilnuje. Jestem bardzo ciekawa, gdzie można znaleźć ten pierścień do skradania się, bo nie wiem, czy chciałabym się tego uczyć. Gorzej, jeżeli był poza miastem. Kurde, no i nie wiem, czy już się pomału opowiadać po której ze stron, czy na razie ze wszystkimi gadać. Kurczę, moi drodzy, myślę, że na dzisiejszy odcinek to byłoby już wszystko. Dziękuję Wam już serdecznie za oglądanie, mam nadzieję, że Wam się film podobał. Jeżeli tak, zachęcam Was do łapki w górę, subskrypcji, komentarza. No i co? I lecę montować dla Was ten film. I lecę montować sobie fotel, bo przyszedł w międzyczasie. Montować? Składać? Kurde, jakby to ująć? Składać chyba bardziej niż montować. No, już nie przedłużam. Dzięki Wam jeszcze raz i cześć!